Welcome to the course of Azure Machine Learning. In our last lecture, we have imported the Azure Machine Learning libraries, wherein we have imported the few of the libraries like the workspace, environment, experiment, and the script and config. In this v, uh, lecture, we would be learning more about how to create a workspace using a Python, right? So let's get started. Here, by using this command, the workspace which we have already imported, we use workspace.create. The name of our workspace name, you can mention anything. I have mentioned demo WS, right? And if the resource group is already present, you can give resource underscore group is equal to analytic. If it is not present and you want to create new, then you need to mention this create resource group equals to true. This will create a new resource group if it is not created. And this would be the subscription ID of your account. So don't copy this because I will not be using this subscription going forward. So this is only for the demo purpose. I have created this account, right? And the location on which you need to create your workspace, your resource group. So it would be the East US 2, right? Now once I'll execute this, so I'll try to execute this. The sign up screen will come, so it will ask for your sign up details. So once you click on your sign up details, you just click next and it will ask for your password. Once you sign up on next, it will verify yes, you are using your Azure Machine Learning uh, portal from your local machine, right? So once you click sign in, it will verify your account. And now, wow, the workspace has been created, right? So over here, you can see that it has deployed the workspace with a app insight. We have, they have also deployed the key vault. They have also created a new storage account uh, with a by default name of demo oil. And uh, it has also created a workspace, right? And it took around 80.5 seconds to create everything. Now, if you wanted to see uh, or if you wanted to uh, place this workspace into a local folder so what you need to do it you need to write ws dot write config dot azure ml right so once you click on this over here you will find that dot azure ml folder has been created with a config.json so this json uh, i'll just open this json file so if you see this json file it will contain your scope and uh, the workspace details uh, where your workspace has been created and uh, on which particular subscription it is created right so now if you wanted to get a detail right so you can see the detail uh, workspace dot from config Here, uh, it will take all the values from this config file and check uh, what all the configuration is required or is being mentioned under this uh, JSON file, right? So here you can see the workspace is created with a name demo, the subscription ID is this, and the resource group is analytics. So the next time when you will create this, so how do you execute this? So what uh, I'll just write a piece of a code. You need to mention try. And if the workspace is created, then you can directly pull it up. Workspace from config, right? And if it is not created, the workspace is still not there, then you need to create this workspace by using this logic right so i'll just copy here and paste and write this file to if it is 
the first time you are creating the workspace yeah so the next time whenever you will be executing you will be executing it if the workspace is present it will take from here otherwise it will create a new workspace for you thank you guys then in the next lecture we would be going ahead with the creation of a compute cluster thank you